Hello, my fellow adventurers! This is Malucha, and welcome back to New World here in Season 2, Blood of the Sands. We are in the middle of the quest chain, the story quest chain for this season. And in the previous episode, we kind of wanted to, well, talk to Malik. Because we had a feeling that we were not obligating to the contract we made with him. And we didn't want to tarnish our name. And he basically tried to kill us. So I think we're done with the contract with Malik. And apparently he wants to hatch some eggs. To take control and destroy ancients from what we could find in the text. So let's see what Grace has to say this week. Or at least today. Hatching a clutch of colossal monsters eager to eat everything in their path? What kind of a lunatic would do such a thing? Well, we need to collect the eggs to keep them from Malik. Oh, so you want to collect more of the bloody things? <laughs> I swear this desert heat must be getting to all of us. All right. Yes, that's the right plan. Where can we find the next egg then? Well, I'll need to see if Rima has found any more information on them. Right. Check with her and see what she can tell you. In the meantime, I'm going to let the Silver Crows know that Malik needs to be stopped at all costs. I hope we never get another miserable bastard for a client. Well, basically the only one you're gonna need to tell this to is to our dear friend on your right side, and then I'm the other Silver Crow. There's only and I'm and I'm gonna talk to <laughs> I'm gonna talk to Rina, so Arathon Staff, a fire staff, intelligence, mortal power. Uh, so empower on a kill. Eh, maybe good for PvE. Because you can get your hands more on kills than in PvP or easier on kills than PvP. Refreshing move, always good, and enchanted, always good as well. I rather saw, instead of mortal power, I rather saw a, a perk, a weapon perk on there. But still not a bad fire staff if you don't really have like a decent one yet. This might actually be a starter decent one, <laughs> I guess. Let's accept, and well, basically the entire crow crew is here. You, Grace. Shall I just say it? Uh, guys, Malik is bad. Everybody heard that? Okay, let's move on. Rima. It's good to see you again. And it's good to I've see you. I've managed to find more information on this mural when you're ready to hear it. And that's what I'm here for. Did you find the second egg? Ah, yes. Well, in a way. Let me explain. The locations of the last two eggs are vague. Oh, it's Probably two eggs? Probably intentionally so. They left clues, but the exact locations are unclear. Well, I have faith in you, Rima. Well, thank you. I have, in fact, managed to find another egg. But I suspect it's not going to be easy. This one mentions something about a word of stone. Well, that makes sense, because the last one was behind a word of water, and it, apparently it is something to do with the elements, right? The mural alludes to the word of stone being a beacon for the egg chamber. There are also a few confusing words, one of which could mean sight or direction. But I think in this context, it's something like map. So the word of stone is a, is a map? Well, the way the mural uses these symbols, I'm more inclined to believe the word of stone activates or possibly reveals a map. Okay. I believe you need to find the word of stone and then use it to activate a map in a special place. Right. What? Find the word of stone, then find the map room. That seems to be the heart of it, yes. Start your search in Diospolis. From what I can gather, they're using an ancient name for that area. And oh, Xander was looking for you. It sounds like you might have company on your way. Oh, that is good news. I, I like Xander. Sander, have you heard Malik is bad? <laughs> there you are, my friend. You look ready to embark on a great adventure. Well, something like that. Are you hoping to join me? Of course. Grace sent word for us to help. I would have arrived sooner, but her map was incredibly faulty. <laughs> Everything was backwards. Ah, wait. It was upside down. That makes so much more sense. Oh, I love this dude. Well, I'm I, I, I'm glad to have you. Meet me at uh, Diospolis. I will, yes. Where is Diospolis? Never mind. I am joking. <laughs> I will pick up a few supplies and meet you there. Sooner or later. 
It's probably after I completed the quest that I'm gonna see him. I kind of feel like. All right, egg hunt. Travel to Diospolis, and that is 1.12 kilometers away. And it is pretty close by to the fast travel points. So let's head to the Mercurial Shrine. Oh, look at that. He's already here. Tanner? I tried to get Dog to stay in New Corsica, but he was not happy about that. Yes, I know, Dog, you have a sensitive nose and don't like big settlements. All right, I completely yes, I forgot about Dog. Now. Did you not hear me? What way did I say it? Well, I'm glad to have you here. So what's your plan? Grace told me you were ambushed before. So Dog and I will keep that from happening again. Okay. We will guard the entrance here and make sure that nobody follows you in. Well, sounds good. I'll return once I find the egg chamber. We will keep a careful watch for you. Be safe in there, my friend. And you be safe there as well. So dog, dog came along as well. Where's dog? Oh, here's dog. Look at that. Bathing in the sun. Dog look up, looks up to you contently. He doesn't seem the least bit bothered by the heat. Yeah, like, like I said, he's bathing in the sun. Dog. Oh, I love it. Like, New World sometimes has the best jokes. Alright, what do we need to do? Collect the Word of Stone from the Eye of the Devourer and search for the Sulfur Elemental Shamans for a way to activate the ancient map. So, we basically need to kill three shamans, if I can understand this correctly. And one Devourer. So, he does have a pretty good pool of health oh he still stunned me now let's heal up dodge out there we go pretty straightforward word of stone collected and now we need to find the shamans right okay, got a chest here definitely want to open that one never know what goodies you might get and where it says 52 meters and we can harvest this dude as well what are we gonna get from this dude okay lodestone okay not bad eight for the shamans doesn't really give us an oh yeah look at that so the dotted line is over here okay so it's the entire area guys so it's not like a specific little spot. They should be automation. There we go. That's one of the dudes we need. Let's dodge this. Let's pull him towards me. So we actually don't. Go ahead and do it. Line of sight him a little. So he actually comes to me. We don't pull anything else. Here he is. And shot missed. And of course we pulled something else. Ooh, you saw that? His trick was still going on in the background. What do you have for me? Staff of the Devourer shards. Okay, so that's one. Uh, just here. We can pick that up. Layered silk gloves. There are some really decent rewards in the chest lately, guys. We definitely up the ante on uh, what can be in here. Where can we find another elementalist? They cannot be like that hidden, right? Oh, there's no one here. And it seems we pulled multiple things. Stay away from him. Yo, he came flying out of the ground. You saw that? Good dodge out. He's using the wind as his weapon as well. He's down. Dodge! Dodge! He's down as well. That's the second one. Oh, did you see his falling cry of death? That was an epic, an epic death. One more. Oh, and there's one more right next door. Really nice. Nope. 
And let's blow him up. There we go. Third one. Search the ancient map. Boom. And that is 140 meters away. So in the corner. Oh, yeah. Right over there. I love these new markers on the map that actually show you where you need to go. And I got a feeling I'm going to like pull everything that's in here. Yes. No. Only the doggy. Okay. That's good. No. No. The left a little bit. Right. Pull the one on the left. Am I gonna be able to go in without actually getting hit? Go, 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 go. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Uninterrupted. Place the word of stone. Oh, look at that. That's a map of Brimstone Sands. Oh, that is pretty cool. And then the sunlight will actually, like, mark a spot on... Yeah, this is so Indiana Jones, guys. Look at how surprised I am. <laughs> okay, this is really, really cool. And it seems we need to talk to Xander the Undying, so let's head on out. Welcome back. As you can see, we had some uninvited guests. So Dog and I uninvited them. <laughs> it seems someone is very interested in your search. But how was it? Did you find the egg chamber? Can you shout a little bit less? Maybe there's people actually trying to listen to our conversation here. I did, and it's uh, in the ruins to the east. Excellent! I am enjoying this adventure with you. Except for all this miserable sand. Well, if one more tiny rock finds its way into my loincloth, I will scream. Ah, ah! <laughs> I can imagine, because he's, he's uh, basically where we found him was. Uh, why, why am I going to the map? We found him in the Great Cleave, right? Great. Uh, no, Eden Grove. I need a Grove is pretty. Welcome back. I Excellent. did. Complete the quest. And it seems so, we trip the desert for us is are gonna end the episode up here, guys. So let's sit our ass down while Xander is yakking in the background there. And end the episode up here. If you want to see more of my quest progression on my Let's Play here in New World Season 2 in the Blood of the Sands or any other game I might play on my channel, guys, just hit that subscribe button. It would always help out a lot. I do hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.